What's up, guys? My name's Kenny. Hope you're all feeling good today. It is Saturday, March 30th. I'm going to play Wordle Connections, the mini crossword, and strands. Yes, I'm going to play strands again, okay? Uh, I just want to try it out. I, I don't want to completely give up on it yet. Is it a game that I have fun with? Not really, but I don't know. I've been doing it. I'm used to it. Let's just keep the routine going for now. But yes, I could easily see it ending soon. So anyway, here's Wordle. Uh, let's put in the word coast today as my starting guess. That should be a pretty good word today. It does give me a couple letters, which is good. Not the letters I was expecting, but a C and an O. Uh, what about like focal? No. Can't be focal or vocal or local because I've already used the A. So what else could it be? Rocky. Let's try Rocky. Okay, there is an R in here. The C is not first or third. Okay, so the R is not first either. Torch? No, we've already used the T. RCH? Porch? Oh, Force? Yes, okay, that was right. I, I realized I still had the E. I just forgot I could just end it in E, and then once I realized that, I kind of put the letters together, and was like, okay, there we go. All right, that was nice. Got Wordle in three. That's always a good thing. So uh, let me know in the comments how you guys did on Wordle. Let's go ahead and uh, move on over to Connections now. Yesterday's... Um, I, I feel like I had the categories. I just didn't... I didn't put it all together that uh, the... Goofy and Daisy, I did think about Disney, and I just didn't think about Lady or Happy being Disney characters, so that's unfortunate. And then I had the whole arm thing, the army thing with, like, Shin and Shiny and stuff, and I just, ah, oh, man, I, I was almost there. I just didn't, I didn't see those. So, here we go. Let's see what we got today. Smokes, jams, cans, mittens. Okay, plurals. Puffs, kettles, spots, oh, are these all plurals? Salts, raindrops, pants, pickles, whiskers, gasps, cures, binds, and huffs. Okay, first thing I see is whiskers and mittens, which I think could be names for cats. But I don't know what else that would be. Okay. Raindrops, that's very interesting. Hmm. Mins and Whiskers just seem like cats' names, so... Smokes? Maybe cat name? Like, I've heard of cats called Smokey, but I don't know about Smokes. Although, Smokes and Puffs? Huffs and puffs, that kind of goes together. Maybe. I don't know if it goes with smokes or not. I guess so, right? Um. I wonder if one of these categories you have to take off the S. <laughs> um, cures... You have pants like you wear. You also have pants like panting. Like the... Hmm. I don't exactly... Okay. So puffs like a puff of smoke or something, right? But is there another meaning for puff or... I'm trying to think of, like, things you do with your mouth, almost. Like, you can gasp, you can... Like, that's what I'm trying to think. Like, does does huff or puff go with that? I'm trying to think of the definitions of huff and puff, and I really don't know. Um, jam... Jam and can? Maybe... No, maybe I'm just thinking... Wow, I'm thinking about just, like... Wait. No, those don't go together. <laughs> uh, or do they? I don't know. I just had a moment where I was thinking about, like, jam. 
<laughs> in a jar, I guess. Um, yeah, this is going to be really tough. I think maybe Pickles is a cat name. Like, I could see that being a name. Spot is like a dog name, but I don't know if Spots is a cat's name. It could be, but... Yeah, we got a really interesting one today. I like that they're, they're doing the whole plural thing or adding an S on the end of everything. Uh, it's nice, but I do think that I'm going to fail. <laughs> um, kettle, like, a kettle has, like, um... What do you call it? Steam? Smoke? Steam, right? Like... Or maybe I'm thinking of, uh... Gosh, I don't have a kettle, so I'm trying to think, am I misremembering the name of that thing? What's the... What, is that the tea thing? Gosh dang it. I don't have a... Um... What is a kettle? <laughs> My brain, like, as, it gets scrambled when I play these games. Words I think I know, I'm, like, second-guessing all the time. I'm thinking, like, getting something jammed, like a door jam, or, like, just jammed to, like, a paper jam or something. Like, if it's jammed, it... Hmm, no. No. Yeah, I don't think there's a, uh, I, there's no way I'm going to get a single category today without guessing. So I'm probably just going to get nothing, which is unfortunate. So my best category so far, I think, is mittens and whiskers and probably pickles. And I guess spots makes a little bit of sense because, you know, a cat could have spots on it. Let's try it, see if it's right. It's not right. And, oh, none of those are even right. Yeah, okay. Maybe mittens and whiskers is right, but maybe spots and pickles are wrong. That could be. Okay. Wait, pickles is also a verb, right? Like you pickle something. Oh my gosh. To pickle it. Cure it, maybe. Can it. Smoke it. One away, close, something, maybe. Hmm. Jam? Pickles? Smoke? Cured? <laughs> I don't know. No, that's I, that lost it. I, I don't. I don't really know. Salt? Cure? Can? Smoke? Oh, these are all. This is the meat thing. Didn't we just have this category? I feel like we just had this like within the past month or few weeks or something. Okay. Well, at least I got one. Um. I mean, I guess we'll just go with huffs, puffs, pants, and gasps for, like, noises you make almost. Breathing heavily. Okay, yeah. that That's... that's. See, that's what I was wondering. Like, does puff mean that? that I, I knew huff meant that, but I wasn't sure if puff meant that. <laughs> yeah, that that's where I was getting kind of tripped up there. See... It just takes playing a game like this to make me go, wait, do I really even know what the word puff means? <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so I really like mittens and whiskers and maybe pickles. But I already tried spots, I think. And that was wrong. Oh, in a bind, in a pickle, in a, like, it's jammed. Oh, is there another one there? Mittens doesn't make sense. Whiskers, I don't think is right. Kettles. It's got to be kettles. I don't know what that means. Unless I've got it wrong. No, that's wrong. Okay. Binds, jam, pickles, and spots. So, like, you're in a spot? Like, a tough spot? A difficult spot? 
Yeah, I just think spots. That's that's. I didn't realize that that was used that way on its own without a word before it, like tough spot. Okay, and then things in my favorite things: kettles, mittens, raindrops, and whiskers. Um, mm, I don't think I understand that one. So, can somebody explain that to me? <laughs> Let me think for a minute. Like, do, am I missing something obvious here? Things in my favorite things. Kettles, mittens, raindrops, and whiskers. And it's a reference to something that I don't know about. It's got to be, because my favorite things is in quotes, and I don't know what that is referring to and since i don't know that immediately like yeah, i think i'm missing something there so what is my favorite things and yeah how does that make any sense okay yeah i i feel like sometimes like sometimes these in these in this game connections um i will say like oh i don't know what this thing is or i say i don't know what this category is and then later on, I realized, yeah, I do know what that is. I don't know why in the moment I wasn't reading it correctly or I, I didn't get it. Like spots here. Like spots immediately did not make sense to me. But then I thought about it and I was like, yeah, I guess it does make sense. But it's just not something that I would think of. It's not what comes to mind for me. And, and so that was difficult for me personally. So, yeah, sometimes like it's not that the category is wrong. It's not like it's a bad category, but sometimes it's just I don't get it. So, like, I know it's kind of confusing for you guys watching when I say something. You might not understand exactly what I'm saying. Um, but sometimes I'm referring to me not getting it. Sometimes I'm referring to I think that the category is bad. In this case, I don't know. Like, with puffs, I didn't quite... That's a me thing, right? <laughs> um, yeah. I'm noticing in the comment section, there's a little bit of, I'm getting frustrated reading some people's comments because I realize that I'm not communicating clearly from my perspective, um, especially with the game Strands. Like, I'm not communicating very clearly, so people interpret something I say as being uh, either people are assuming I don't understand something when I just made a comment that was poorly worded. And I really, I did understand it. It's just... And the other thing is, like, sometimes people think that when I when I say something that's sort of emotionally, um, like, if I say something out of frustration that's sort of got this emotional tone to it, like, sometimes people think that I'm making a bigger deal about something than I really am. So people leave comments like, hey, you know, it's okay, or, you know, hey, maybe you need to do this. People try to help me because they see I'm frustrated. And there's, there's a lot, I'm reading a lot of comments now that kind of, like, I'm not really liking some of the comments I'm reading because I realize that it's probably on my end not communicating properly. So I want to communicate better specifically what my emotions are, what my expectations are for you guys as far as responding to me. Because um, it does get frustrating for me to read certain comments that um, that where people are making assumptions about... Or people are, are interpreting... Not assumptions, but people are interpreting what I say in a different way than what I expect, so it's leading me to feel frustrated when I read the comments. So I just want to kind of voice that a little bit because I can see that coming up a lot on this channel, and I want to sort of just work on how I communicate so I don't run into the problem of getting frustrated when I read your guys' comments, trying to help. When everybody's just trying to help me. Everybody's just trying to make suggestions or give me feedback, but a lot of times it's like, Oh, yeah, I'm reading the comment from you guys, and I clearly see, see that you guys don't really understand what I'm thinking or what I'm feeling from my perspective. So I got to just make sure that you guys do understand from my perspective what I am thinking, what I am feeling, what I am what I understand, and what I don't understand. It's just this whole thing of just, I just need to communicate better. <laughs> took a while for me to just try to make that point. I apologize, guys. But hopefully you guys understand that... Um, uh, like, I do appreciate people trying to help me, but sometimes it's, yeah, sometimes it's, it's, there is a little bit of misinterpretation on, on your guys' end that I, I really want to try to correct. And it's not your fault. Again, communication. If somebody doesn't understand you or if they're interpreting you 
in a way that's not the way you want them to interpret it, it's because you're not communicating clearly. So I'm not putting it on people. It's just, I mean, maybe I did say something there that did kind of make it sound like that, but all right, that's enough. Let's, that's enough. Let's, let's get, get on from this. We got two games. We got the mini, which I think is the bigger mini today. And, um, and then we have strands, which I, I was like, I, I basically flipped the coin today, which was, am I going to play strands or not? And I ultimately decided, let me give it another shot. But anyway, we got the mini first, so. Yeah, let's go ahead and do this. Big mini today. It is Saturday. So let's have some fun with this. All right. Fill in teachers. Uh, uh, subs, substitute teachers, pad, tie, ingredient, often. I don't know what that means. Well, I do know what that means. Well, I don't know what pad, tie, ingredient, pad, Hi, yeah, I don't think I get it. A uh, person who helps in buying a home. Real it, realtor? No, Re realtor. Is it just realtor or realtor? A realtor. Is that right? I don't know. That's gross. You. Is that how you spell you or is it just E W? Then that that might be wrong if it's just. I don't know. Is that even how you spell realtor? <laughs> Is it realtor or realtor? Hmm. I don't know. Maybe this is a... <laughs> All right. I just realized I don't know that. How do I not know? How do I not know that? I don't know what Magnon is. Mag... Okay, let me take a moment to think. Do I know what that is? Magnon. Magnon? Yeah, I don't think so. Paid back through an app? Paid back. Uh, paid back through an app. Paid back. I don't quite get it. Um, through an app too, man. Oh, yeah. Okay. Twelve across. I would be blank if I didn't mention. I would be blank if I didn't mention. I know this one. I would be blank if I didn't mention. There is a there is a particular word here that fits that makes the most sense. Hmm. Ah, I, that sucks because I do know that one. Connery, who played Bond. Connery. I don't know. Oh, that sounds familiar. Sean Connery? I don't, like, I don't know people's names. Um, it's tough because, like, I hear, it's like, I had this group of, like, names that I know, and I have this group of, like, faces that I've seen, but there's a lot of times where, like, I don't realize, oh, that person that I know, that's, and that name that I know, that's the, that is, that's how that, <laughs> you know? All right, I'm bad at explaining things. Okay, I need to work on my communication skills, clearly. Um, indigenous group once led by to to come take take them take them take them say um don't know what that is safari destination uh that's a url right it's the only thing that makes sense there most valued crypto that is obviously bitcoin uh snacks made on sticks snacks made on sticks um, okay. Channels that stink? I don't get that. Channels that stink. Eggs on... Can't think of it. Excite with up? Rev up? Maybe? Combat sport? MMA? Uh, had that ingredient. Pad, not that. Oh my gosh, I read that as that. It's Thai. Right, that is Thai, right? Oh my gosh. That's gross. E is it just E-W-W? -W? Like, is that how you spell that? Um, I don't know what this 9 across is. 10 across. Is this Venmo? 
Is that, how do you spell, is that Venmo like this? That is crazy. So it was a specific app. I didn't even, yeah, okay. I would be, I thought it was like remissed or something, but I don't know how to spell that. Or something like that. Maybe it's not remissed. Maybe I'm getting that confused with the actual word. I don't know. Well, I don't know how to spell it, so that doesn't even matter. I would be something miss? Something miss? Mized? Remised? Something mized. Snacks made on sticks. S'mores. There we go. Channels that stink? Sewers? Eggs on... Don't know. I would be. Oh man, maybe that's not. Oh, I don't know this indigenous group. I I've heard of this before, but I don't know what it is. So I I, I definitely can't. I don't know what this letter is. Like it would make sense once I read it, but I don't know what it is. Um. Uh, five across. Don't know. Six down. Eggs on. Uh, is it Remise? I think I can't get these last ones. I don't know five across. I don't know six down. I don't know nine across. I don't, I, I don't know one down either. I think I can't get these ones. Let's see what it is. Um, Shrimp? Oh, okay. Shawnee. Yeah, okay. Yeah, it makes sense. I didn't know. What is this? Bro, Magden, I don't know what that one, so if you guys want to tell me what that one is, feel free to. Prods? Remiss. I would be remiss. That's how, that's how that goes? It's not remissed? Okay, I don't under, I don't know what the definition of remiss is. So, I mean, of course I'm not going to understand. Um, I feel stupid for not knowing that. that uh, I thought, I see, when I read that, my first thought was remiss or remissed um but i don't know what it means i don't know what remiss really means so i just thought that remiss didn't fit so i didn't know what it was or yeah okay i knew it was something like that though but uh s'mores i can't believe i didn't get that i was trying to think of what it was but with just an s and o at the beginning when i first read it i didn't know um Anyway, Sean Connery, again, I know the name. I don't know the face. When I see the face, I'll be like, oh, yeah, I know who that is. But now I can say, oh, yeah, that's Sean Connery. Although I can't now because I actually don't know yet. I have to actually look it up. <laughs> uh, um, Shawnee. Okay, I have to remember that. Shawnee. Uh, Sewers was a clever clue. Didn't get it at first, but... Yeah, U is apparently spelled E-W-W. -W. Um... URL. I wonder how many people don't know that Safari is a browser. I'm sure people do know that. Cause is is what's is Safari specific for like iPhones, or what is it, or is it just any any smartphone? I guess I don't know. I don't use Apple products. Um, prods. I don't know what. Yeah, I don't know what Exxon Prods is. Am I reading that wrong? Probes. Hmm, I don't know. Okay, yep. A lot of stuff here I just didn't know. I didn't know that shrimp was a uh, pad thai ingredient. I don't know, what is pad thai? Is pad thai a thing? <laughs> or is it just pad and thai? I, I don't, I, yeah, wow. I just realized I was reading that probably wrong. Um, I, I feel like I want to look that one up. Is it pad thai as one thing or pad and then thai? I, I'm, Pad Thai is a dish, got it, I was thinking of it as Thai as a, like, type of food or something, like Thai food, or whatever, I don't know, and then Pad being, like, I don't, I didn't know what Pad meant, that's the thing, is I thought it was like a, yeah, yeah, okay, that was, that was, yeah. All right. 
Uh, let's move on. Okay. I could just say, screw it. I'm not going to play strands today. Give everybody... <laughs> uh, just lie to you guys. Everybody's expecting it from the beginning of the video of me playing strands, and then I don't. Um, but no, I will. Okay. Kind of don't want to, but... All right. Let's see what we got in strands. Camouflage. Okay. Camouflage. What could camouflage be? Things that are hidden. Um... Camouflage. F. F. Nef. Mm. A lot of A's here. Slug. Um. Dal. Toll. Hint. Uh, hyena. So it's just animals. Okay. Um, is it just animals? Uh, cheetah? There we go. I wonder if I would have got... I feel like I could have got cheetah without using the hint. I went straight for the hint because, well, <laughs> the strands have been frustrating, frustrated with it lately. Um, but I feel like seeing E-E-T-A-H, I'm going to be like, oh yeah, that's got to be cheetah. And that's exactly... Yeah. So... These are African animals. Is the word African on here? Afri... No, I don't think so. Um... Tiger? Is tiger on here? There's T, there's I. I don't think so. It's not African, but I just thought... With the letters and like camouflage tigers are pretty camouflaged um leopard one oh i thought it wasn't there for a second and seeing that jump from r to d kind of that's kind of tough um okay so the spangram is going to go this way so Um, so why here? I guess I don't know what the spangram is going to be. Uh, it might be, might be time for another hint. Um, <laughs> potty. Is it just spotty, though? Oh. <laughs> yeah, that's funny. Okay. Uh, things that are spotty. Leopard, cheetah, hyena. Um, Dalmatian? No. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I that that was tough. Okay. I guess like I knew it had to be Dalmatian, but I'm like, how do you spell Dalmatian? And I was thinking about it, and I'm like, then I then trying to like both figure out how to spell a word that I didn't know how to spell and try to locate the letters. A little tough. Took me a minute. Giraffe. Okay. And then is it ladybug? Okay, I saw a bug, but I it's weird. I saw a bug and I thought of like ladybug, but I didn't even look for the word. Okay. Well, there you go. That was a pretty quick strands because I used the hints immediately and just said, I don't care. <laughs> and I got it done. All right. So there we go. A longer video. I did a lot of talking in this one. Um, yeah. I mean, once again, I just appreciate you guys. Uh, leave a comment. Let me know. You know, some of the things that I specifically said, I didn't know. Uh, it is nice if you guys do help me out in that way and, and help me helping me understand specific words or things that I don't get. Um, I appreciate all the support on the channel. Uh, let me know in the comments just how you guys did on any of them. 
Uh, and with that being said, I will see you guys tomorrow in another video. Have a good one. See you guys then.